Hi, welcome back to my vlog, Peace of Life. Um, today I wanna to talk about hair. So again, if you looked at some of my videos prior to this, I am talking about the LA girl and just kind of like how she dresses and how it's very effortless and chic. So I wanted to show you two little quick hairstyles that I've seen everywhere. Um, you know, and I just think it's a great little look and it's something that I see on a lot of LA girls. And again, anything I'm showing you can transfer to where you live. But the first thing I wanna show you is the hair tuck. I just think the hair tuck is so cool and so chic and it kind of just like updates your look. So my hair right now is just down and it's fine. You know, it looks cute, easy breezy. But what I love is if you put your hair behind your back and then I talked about this jacket. So if anything that I'm wearing, you can go to my vlog prior to this and it'll be on there. So you just put your hair behind your back and then get your denim, oversized denim jacket. And then you just kind of tuck your hair in and it just looks so chic and effortless. I mean, look at that. Literally, I look so much more pulled together. Honestly, wow, I look a lot more pulled together. Just by putting that over my um, shoulders and tucking in my hair, I just think it's an easy, effortless look if you don't know what to do with your hair and you have it down. And then also, I know everybody's kind of into that bob rage and I definitely want one. I mean, I'm lusting over um, Selena Gomez's hair. I love Kendall Jenner's hair. Every day I contemplate it, and I've been talking about it probably for the last year, so that's what you'll know about me. When I want something or I wanna do something, I definitely talk about it. You won't be surprised by it. You'll be like, she finally did it. But tucking your hair in kind of gives you that look of a bob, so you can kind of get the idea of how it would look, which I think it looks pretty cute. But that hair tuck really does pull it all together, and I just love how that looks. So my next one's gonna be, I recently told a friend about this cause she wasn't sure how to wear her hair um, the other night and we were out somewhere and then she went to go put her hair in just like a high bun and I was like, oh no, like the way you're dressed cause she had on a great pair of high-waisted flared jeans and a great cropped, um, actually the shirt that I showed you guys yesterday in my other video about the LA Girls Basics, she has that rolled tee from Topshop but she has it in a crop. And she was gonna go put her hair in a high bun and I said, oh, do your hair like this. It'll give you kind of like the same effect but it just looks so chic and it just looks so stylish and it just works and it's easy to do. Okay, so bear with me, you guys. So all you do, okay, you're gonna laugh at me but just putting your hair back and rolling it around like your fingers and then rolling it around in the back and then take your whatever you want to have whatever band you have you know um, hair band put that around here and then just kind of pull your pieces out okay again it's fit okay it is scary how much more put together I look. Look at that. It just looks so chic. Like again, I'm going to reference to some of the people that I am probably too old to have as my inspirations, but I love Kendall Jenner and she's always wearing, if you look at her hair, she always has her hair pulled back and it just looks so chic. And like, if you're going to work, look how easy that was. My hair, I mean, it hasn't been washed in a couple days, so I think it actually works better, but it's just so easy if you're going to work. I mean, just imagine wearing a tailored blazer, some of those items I showed you yesterday, a great pair of skinny jeans and a heel. If you're a student and you just wanna throw on a big sweatshirt and leggings and some trainers and go to school, you know, just, I mean, it's just so easy, look at that. And then a lot of times she'll wear her hair also behind her ears. This is gonna look even better, okay. So you just put it behind your ears. And look how like, chic that looks I mean it's kind of insane if you look at the last two hairstyles compared to how I started out the video what a difference and then again pump up that chicness and then throw this on over your shoulders look at that and then just throw on with this right now it's kind of like a sweatshirt dress but I would wear this with a pair of skinny like leather jeans and you're like I mean, look at that, ready to go. So I'm gonna get up and show you the dress. I'm, it's, it's definitely short, but see, look at that. I mean, I would wear it as a dress here in LA, and then I'm just wearing my K-Swiss. And I mean, come on, this could definitely be a Kendall Jenner kind of knockoff inspiration, maybe? I don't know, you guys decide. But that's it, and you're just like ready to go. 
and she sent me my friend sent me a text message and she said since I've been doing my hair like this I love it I just feel so chic and put together and then she was also saying like for going to the gym she just loves putting her hair back like this because it just looks more you know chic and stylish I mean just from where I started out with the video with my hair down these are just easy looks that you can wear to work, you can wear to school, you can just throw your hair back. I love that little tuck in the um, jacket. And don't forget, you can also tuck it in your collar. The best way to get that tuck is if you have your hair down and then put your like sweatshirt or sweater or t-shirt down over your hair and then put your arms in your like, you know, um, top and then let it tuck. So don't go back and like tuck it in after your hair is already down with your shirt on. It's best if you kind of tuck it and go over. I'm pretty impressed. I'm pretty impressed. And the gl the Becca glow on my cheeks is pretty real. Whoa. Okay, so I'm gonna talk about that next on my next video. I'm gonna get into my little arsenal here and I'm gonna show you some of my go-to items that I'm loving right now. Most of them are all from Sephora. Um, so I think to get a head start on like, if you wanna get some new makeup or some new fall ideas, I will go over that next. And I'll talk about this little bag that I am really, really in lovable. And it's like cheap and cheerful and it's just a great little clutch. Um, it's actually a great knockoff too for Fendi. Um, I wanna say Fendi and Balenciaga did a really cool fur bag, but I just love the colors. I mean, burgundy and this dark navy blue. All right, guys, so I'm so happy you joined me. Um, I appreciate it stopping by and watching my video. And if you like what I'm doing and showing you for some like, effortless looks as far as beauty and hair and fashion that will make you look in chic and just like off-duty model, please give me a thumbs up and come back and see me. Give me a thumbs up and please subscribe. And again, as my blog is called Peace of Life, please today and every day do something for yourself. You deserve it. That's what life is for. Do Go for a nice walk, you know, have a glass of wine, have a nice cup of hot tea, take a hot bath, listen to some music, you know, get in your car and drive around. I love doing that with my music blaring. Just anything that makes you happy, you know, do it. I mean, it just you need to do that for your soul. You deserve that. It's just, it'll make your life so much happier when you're in a place of self-care. So come back and see me. I'm going to talk about makeup in my next vlog. And I hope these hairstyles work because I mean, I did them and I cannot believe the transformation of how much more put together I looked than if I just walked out with my hair down. The tuck and the and the bun is working. I'm liking it. All right, guys, have a great evening and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.